Hey everyone, and welcome to Fiddler's Friday. Alice Hazen here, and um, I am excited to offer you a couple of Ukrainian folk songs today. Um, as I was thinking about what to do for this week's Fiddler's Friday, well, you know, following um, following last week when I did the Ukrainian national anthem, I decided to. Uh, go with more Ukrainian songs. And it's nice to see you, Gordon, on the stream. I actually was just gonna say that Gordon Nash, my friend up north, uh, suggested a song to me. And um, while that particular song was a little out of my uh, out of my time frame for this Fiddler's Friday, maybe one day, it was sort of like a prog rock song that was about Ukraine. Um, by a band called Renaissance, I think. And uh, it was called Ukraine Ways. So check it out, it's very cool. Um, and I was gonna do everything with like a cool loop pedal thing. And you know, in the end I just decided maybe I should keep it simple. And so I got onto my computer this morning and looked up some Ukrainian folk songs and did some research and uh, did some transcribing. And uh, if I make a mistake, I'm just gonna blame it on my sloppy handwriting here. I'm definitely, whoopsie, I'm definitely not an engraver or anything. So, you know, just heads up. <laughs> but um, I actually found some really wonderful tunes. So I'm excited to share them with you. Um, just wanna say hi, of course, to everyone joining the stream today. Gordon, my friend, of course. Mike, the, uh, the guru of, um, Periscope Musician and Friends, Cam, Bestie in Clarksdale, Douglas, Dad, Len, Ruth. Uh, thank you all for joining so much. It's so good to see everyone um, watching and interested in hearing some Ukrainian sounds today. Um, I will say that, you know, there's definitely been a mixture of emotions um, this week. I mean, I have fun and happy things happening in my own life, but then it's just you know, an ever-present thing on my mind, uh, the situation in Ukraine and the incredible um, bully and murderer that Vladimir Putin is, is just, he just is constantly surprising everybody with how far he's willing to go. And it's really scary. Um, so I've been doing some crying and, you know, thinking about everything this week and yeah, and this is a good way for me to process it, and I hope for you guys, too. Hey, Suzanne, good to see you today. Hope all is well in Hernando. Hope your puppies are doing well. I miss them on the stream. <laughs> anyway, everyone's here. So the last thing I'm going to say before I begin with these wonderful melodies is um, ways to help. We got UNICEF, Doctors Without Borders. We got Voices of Children. These are ways that you can help if you're looking for ways to help out. Sunflower of Peace, International Committee of the Red Cross, waiting for the feed here, Save the Children, UN Refugee Agency, CARE, and International Medical Company. Uh, another cool way that I saw somebody online was helping out was um, just purchasing a night at a Ukrainian bed and breakfast or a Ukrainian um, Airbnb because you know, these people have businesses and you can give the money, the money directly to them. So that was a really cool idea that I saw somebody post online was uh, just book yourself a night at a Ukrainian Airbnb. You don't have to go, but uh, you know, you can get that money directly to some people who might be able to use it. Or uh, of course, choose one of these fantastic organizations. So yeah, I'm gonna bring you some Ukrainian joy today. That's what they were saying on the news. It's just, hey, remember to share stories of joy, as well as the incredibly sad stories that we're hearing everywhere. There's also, um, you know, these people are finding ways to still find joy in life, and that's really inspiring. All right. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know any of the names of these tunes, but I do know the name of one of them, and I'll share that with you when I play it. But here's one by Dmitry Kabalevsky. It's just called Ukrainian Folk Song. <laughs> Thank you. 
these are dances, uh, wonderful dances from folk music in Ukraine. Thank you, Matt, for saying hi. And uh, yeah, thanks for considering everybody. Thank you for considering just uh, putting something towards this cause here. Alrighty. In the garden, flowers are growing. This is from a collection of two Ukrainian folk songs. Uh, I couldn't find a free version of the first one, but I did find a free version of this one. And I'm going to read you the lyrics because they're kind of, I think it's about a young lady who is walking through the garden. Flowers are growing. Things are blooming, if you know what I mean. And uh, she's causing some trouble. She's basically an apple of discord amongst the male members of the garden. So amongst the boys, she's uh, creating a lot of chaos with her walk through the garden. Sort of a girl from Ipanema type uh, theme is what I'm getting from it. So it goes, in the garden, in the garden, flowers are growing. Tum ta dra ta tum ta dra. Boys will quarrel where I'm going. Tum ta dra ta tum ta dra. Hey, hoy, hoy, ahoya. How my little head is aching, hoy, hoy, hoya, hoya. Oh, the trouble I am making. Boys, to quarrel is so crazy. Tom ta drit ta tom ta dra. Pretty girls are always lazy. Tom ta drit ta tom ta dra. Hoy, hoy, hoya, hoya. How my little head is aching. Hoy, hoy, hoya, hoya. Oh, the trouble I am making. spunky one. I like that a lot. <laughs> nice, Matt. He says we all stand for a girl boss, <laughs> or we stand tall for a girl boss. <laughs> That's right. Make that trouble. That's what I say. All right. This third and last selection, I credit to Patty Kusterok. Uh, if you type her in on YouTube, P-A-T-T-I-K-U-S-T-U-R-O-K. She is a fiddler, and I basically transcribed a medley of Ukrainian songs today. Um, and this one I just really loved. She calls it a Ukrainian folk medley. So go online, go on YouTube, find her. She's got a pianist with her, which I certainly don't have today. And it really is a fun medley. And she talks about how she was thinking of her um, grandfather, who was Ukrainian, um, as she plays. So really wonderful. Just want to make sure I'm supporting her, shouting her out, giving credit where credit is due, of course. But um, so, yeah, wish I could tell you the names of these songs, but I'm sure we'll have fun with them nonetheless. <laughs> Thank you. 
Alrighty. Well, like I said, good to remember the joyful things in life and uh, the beauty that this country has, Ukraine, has given to the world and continues to give. I don't know if you guys have ever uh, made a Ukrainian Easter egg, but that's one of the things that I learned about in my childhood that I just loved um, the uh, way that they make Easter eggs, for example. So just beautiful things um, and such a vibrant culture and such a strong people as we have seen. Um, so yeah, thoughts are with them today and thoughts are also with you today and just hoping that everybody is well and um, that wherever you are, you are enjoying life and making each day count. So anyway, like I said, there's a lot of ways to help there at the bottom. Please consider um, making a donation to one of these wonderful charities so that we can all pitch in. Or book yourself at a Ukrainian Airbnb and uh, post about your trip on TripAdvisor. Anyway, love you guys. Happy Friday. I'll see you next week.